Hey, what is up guys? Chunky Monkey 40 here with another Dukes of Hazard behind the scenes video. Today I think you guys are gonna get something pretty cool. So I just finished One Arm Bandits and I'm about to watch it for the first time ever. I haven't seen the final cut yet and so I figured I'd video watching it for you guys to watch with me. I think that'll be pretty exciting guys. So be sure to leave a like and also subscribe to the YouTube channel. And also if you haven't already, go and check out Motorized Civil War. Because if John Schneider liked it, then I think you will too. So I'm gonna click it right out of my uh right out of my editor, which I use Sony Vegas Movie Studio Platinum 11 to edit videos. So in case you were wondering, that's where I edit all my videos. I'm gonna see what I need to fix in the video. I don't even know if there's gonna be like mistakes that I'm gonna fix in this video. Um, but I will give you guys some director's commentary over it. So that'll be pretty exciting. Anyways, we're gonna get right into it. Um, I need to actually, oh God, I wish I had headphones. Um, oh, playing on the wrong monitor. Oh no. Oh, no, 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 no. Welcome to Hazard County. Cody Roy doing that voice. You probably noticed there's something different here. Well, this is Hazard County. They do things different here. This is Bo Duke and Luke Duke. They're cousins. They fight the system. You know, when I got up this morning, the biggest thing on my mind was to do a little rabbit hunt. Yeah, and then the hound dog runs off. My car is taken. And now we're chasing the sheriff's car. <laughs> ain't you glad we ain't in the big city where life gets complicated? <laughs> Jeff Hold Stewart. It, man, what are you doing? Taking a break? Well, if you'd have tuned this car instead of chasing women last night, we'd have already had him. Not with you asleep at the wheel. Wow, it actually has turned out side. pretty dang good. You grab it. Well, I can't. I'm driving. Is that what you call it? Huh. Try not to lose him, okay? Well, it wouldn't be much of a chase if we do. <laughs> the mailbox spot. That cheesy transition I had to do between two clips. <laughs> wow, I think I the sound effects that I did for the engines really turned out better than I thought they would. You know what? I kind of admire the way he handles that. That turnover thing. scene took us like 10 takes, so thank you, Jokester 18, for being willing to work with me on that. Well, <laughs> shoot fire and save box matches. <laughs> Cooter Davenport, you ain't got the sense the good Lord promised a turkey. <laughs> hey, Luke, what's we'll it, Bo? Ain't you gonna see what he did with your car? You borrowed <laughs> my car. What did you do with it? Oh, I used it to run the sheriff off the road and make him mad. And when he jumped out... You jumped into his, right? Well, why did you steal the sheriff's car? Well, he impounded mine. Seemed only fair to take his. Using my car? Oh, that's real good, Cooter. Well, I told you not to let <laughs> Cooter your car. Cooter, do you realize what it's going to take to straighten all this out? No. And there's this spot. To 40 years of the Dukes of Hazard, and hopefully many more. Long live Hazard Nation, and long live the General Lee, too. That looks better than I thought it would. <laughs> Forgot to put that in the end. Wow, that honestly turned out better than I thought it would. There's, um, I think I caught like two mistakes that I want to fix in it, um, including the uh, Luke Duke, he's gonna have to redo one line where he says, you borrowed my car. What did you do with it? It's supposed to be, uh, you borrowed my car this morning. What did you do with it? Um, but other than that though, that, I'm really proud of that. I think that this will definitely, I hope this goes over well with you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it and I hope you guys really at least appreciate the hard work that we put into making every single shot be a parallel to the original One Armed Bandits. Like I, I've watched that video, like as you guys saw, I was lip syncing some of the lines 
Because I've read, I've listened to these so much, you know, I've got, this is the script that I used for it. Yeah, it truly was uh, a pain in parts, like especially that turnover scene. It took uh, Jokester 18 a good like five or six tries to get that car to turn over like that in GTA. You know, it, it took, uh, and thank you Zach Cash for also helping out with the filming as well. I'm just very proud of it. Let me know in the comment section if you guys feel that I did it justice and that I did my job correctly. Because me being my own personal critic, there's only, you know, those three mistakes which I'm gonna fix before I upload the final version. But yeah, I'm very proud of that video. And uh, actually, I'll give you guys a couple little hinters into uh, the editing process. So all of the car sounds that you hear in the Dixie horn, all that stuff, that's all sound effects. That's not in the video game. And oh my God, I'm speaking of the video game. I, have, I haven't uploaded this yet. By now, you guys have already seen it. This video will have released March 4th. But guys, oh my God, how many times do I have to say this to people? Well, I hope to God it doesn't happen. I'm honestly just gonna delete the comments if it happens on this video. The Confederate battle flag is not in GTA 5, which is where these videos are made. So please don't point it out in the comment section that the flag is not on the car. I know it's not on the car. I made the video. Okay, that's why I put it at the end, and that's why in Motorized Civil War and Lee vs. Lee, there is a big five second long disclaimer that says, and I quote, disclaimer in big letters. Yes, I do know that the flag on the General Lee is wrong, but the Confederate battle flag isn't in GTA 5, so I can't put it on the car. Do not point it out in the comment section. And no, I can't mod it in because I am on the Xbox One. What more do I have to say? I just feel like people are very sensitive about that flag. You know, pe like there's a big group of people of that want it on the car, and then there's a big group of people that don't want it on the car. Me personally, I want it on the car, but Rockstar Games, the makers of Grand Theft Auto V, didn't want it to be an option to put on the car, so they decided that it wouldn't be an option. So it's not my choice to not have it on the car. If it were my choice, it would be on the car, but it's not. It's Rockstar Games. So if you're gonna get mad about it not being on the car, take it up with Rockstar games oh my god and then this part of the video where the general lee jumps and the roscoe car jumps getting that rev limiter to go really loud when the car jumps was so hard that's why you could somewhat hear the horns in the background of it because um i couldn't mute that out because i had to use the actual sound effect from the show but the background track from that show episode was still mixed into the track and there was no way i could take it out so i had to just throw it in there like that so you can hear like a couple down da down da down I think that's what it sounds like you here I'll play it really quick you probably noticed there's something different here well oh the the Dixie horn cut it over that's cool but yeah you can hear the engine go like Wah! you probably noticed there's something different here well like it did in the show I need to turn the background volumes up a little bit you probably noticed there's something different here well, this is Hazard County. But other than that, guys, there's a few things I'm gonna proof on this thing before I really sit on in YouTube, but I figured I'd still video this and I'll still upload this reaction to me watching it for the first time, just because I know that you guys really enjoy me giving you guys some director's commentary um, and like a little bit of an insight into these videos. That's why I do all the behind the scenes and stuff. Also, let me know in the comments section if you would like me to release the rest of the motorized civil war behind the scenes, because I still have about three hours or so left from those behind the scenes. So if you want me to go through those and edit those, then please let let me know in the comment section. Oh, and also if you guys would like a director's commentary of Dukes at Fault and Motorized Civil War, let me know in the comment section as well. But anyways, guys, with all that said and out of the way, I am ChunkyMonkey40 at YouTube.com. One Arm Bandits will be linked at the very top of the description, followed by Motorized Civil War. So if you guys want to go check those videos out, that'd be awesome. But anyways, guys, with all that said and out of the way, I am ChunkyMonkey40 at YouTube.com. Stay rebel, y'all. Man, it's good to be back making Dukes of Hazard videos again. Dukes of Hazard 5 is coming later on this year. Just some good old boys. Never mean no harm. It beats all you ever saw in a trouble.